It's a couple Jordan 1 retros and they gotta be in your collection You just collect them, you never gon' step in I can respect it, but that ain't for me I gotta lace up these black cement threes and throw a little fit together Get on the go out, play some bid and hopefully I can just hit forever I'm from the bottom of the one to rap this part of our culture, you gotta be fly Round flowing with the air force What's going on YouTube? It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist And y'all rocking with your boy in the sneaker dungeon, y'all Hope everyone's having a great day today, today, y'all Look, I'm gonna be honest, I forgot I even picked this shoe up. I was finna shoot another video today, and I was like, y'all know how we rock over here on the channel, man. I like showing y'all everything that I get. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing one of these pickups that I actually got like a week and a half ago, and I just haven't gotten around to doing the video for it. So y'all already know if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell, head over to Instagram and follow your boy at the Retro Wiz Kid. And with all that being said, let's get straight to it. Yeah! Ah, so y'all, it's been very rough on the sneakers app for your boy. I'ma do a full detailed video discussing everything because I'm gonna get these other videos you guys so you guys can check out some of my latest pickups. Um, I do have a video that I'll drop that is gonna be probably the best Nike dunk to release in my personal opinion so far for 2023. And I know you know the hype for dunks is yeah, you know what I'm saying? It used to be crazy, but I still buy what I like and rock what I like. So I really was messing with these and I had to pick them up. But this one right here, another one that was, you know, in the beginning, I think people was feeling these like crazy. Now I did buy these off GOAT. I ended up hitting on these a, like maybe the, a day or two before these dropped on the sneakers app. The way that my sneakers app is set up right now. When I release that video telling you guys about all the stuff that's been going on with it, you guys are gonna be like, damn, G, that, that sucks, like, for real. But it is what it is, man. Hopefully we can get this thing adjusted and we can get back to normal, you know, business when it comes to sneakers at. But this one right here, man, this was an Air Jordan 1. And of course, you guys see the box. The hype for the Air Jordan 1 has died down tremendously, especially over the last two years. I feel like, you know, the resale is not there unless it's really a Travis Scott or it's like something stupid, stupid limited. I mean, you know, I think the Zion Williams was probably one of the one Jordan 1 lows or Jordan 1, it don't even matter if it's a low or a high, that really did something last year, in my personal opinion, that was not like overly, overly hyped. But, you know, they ended up selling out, of course, and then the price went up on them. That's one that really climbed up a little bit that shot me. But this one right here, official name and colorway, is the Women's Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG atmosphere white muslin sale and again i got these from goat these are a size 12 and y'all know the vibes man y'all know the vibes i already took a peek at them and everything it's no secret to what they are but we do have these joints right here y'all yes sir man and i must say I definitely feel like this was one of those that was just a must cop to add to the collection, especially when it comes to the Air Jordan 1s, man. I, I know some people might be like, nah, you know, it's a women's shoe. It's not really my cup of tea. But y'all know, if y'all been rocking with your boy Retro over here on the channel, y'all know that the Air Jordan 1 is my favorite Air Jordan retro silhouette so it was only right that i got these to go along with the others man so originally the first release that came out that kind of had the effects like this would have been the turbo green now when the turbo green came out you know a lot of people actually it was going for a good little little price in the beginning then like when they finally dropped yo they dropped nobody really wanted them then out of nowhere man it seemed like price went buku crazy on these joints man and um yeah i had a double up of these and i sold it you know and it's good it's all good because you know i still got this pair right here of course you already know they've been worn and you know it's a solid colorway and i like how this pair right here plays off of similar vibes of how they did this now of course this one having the distressed tongue and everything and also having you know the words right there and a different type of material for the inner and outer panel in the toe box and these right here being that classic look you know just having the regular toe box and everything i do like how they did do kind of like the 
age looking tongue right here and i know man that jump bright man my camera i might have to turn that jump down i know that brightness looking bright but the, you know kind of got like a cell type vibe to it and then the cell on the midsole matching it and then going around the ankle collar i like all that I think that that is a very nice hit to the sneaker and then we had the hyper royal hyper royals another one but you guys can see also having that same type of vibe y'all already know when it comes to this pair right here i'm gonna be leaving the laces in with them i i honestly just feel like it's too late to really do like a on feet and everything in these but i mean if y'all really want one i'll do it for you but i definitely think that it's a little bit too late for that but this is why i continue to cop these because i like the vibe of how these look you know it gives it a different type of look to the sneakers a new colorway i love the colorway i think that it hits hard i already got a couple fits lined up for these right here so stay tuned make sure you guys are following your boy over on instagram at the retro Wiz kid and there's also supposed to be a lavender pair that is supposed to be releasing this year lavender purplish you know whatever you however you want to look at it but these joints hard g you know what i'm saying and you know i'm pretty sure that these probably there's a lot of people out there that might say at least guys that might be like yo i would have got these if they had been in a extended size going past a size 10 and a half in men's but you know i get it they do a lot of sneakers for the ladies this is definitely one in my personal opinion you know what I'm saying wear what you want rock what you want i ain't care it was a woman's release you know i wanted to get them because i thought it's hit but it is your boy the retro whiz kid my apologies y'all i'm telling y'all man your boy has really been busy with work man Work has been kicking my ass. I am not gonna lie to you. I, I'm about to start back going to school. So I'm saying working towards that next degree. So y'all already know how we rock, man. I still will be pumping the videos out. I'm gonna get back in my bag, get a little bit better with the consistency, man. And when y'all hear about the Nike video that I'm gonna be dropping on this about the sneakers app and everything, you guys will kind of see where I'm coming from as far as how hard it has been for your boy to get sneakers, man. It has just been crazy out here, over here in the Pacific Northwest with me being a able to get sneakers and I'm gonna just lay down a little bit of how things have played out over the last couple years leading into this area right here and y'all understand where I'm coming from when I do that but y'all already know I truly do appreciate everybody that's been rocking with your boy if you guys are new to the channel make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell head over to Instagram and follow your boy at the retro whiz kid and until the next video peace love and Laguna Beach and we out this thing Get it! It's a couple Jordan 1 retros and they gotta be in your collection You just collect them, you never gon' step in I can respect it, but that ain't for me I gotta lay so deep, let's see me threes and throw a little fit together Get on the go, I'll play some bid and hopefully I can just hit forever I'm from the bottom, a little one arrive with this part of our culture, you gotta be fly Where I'm flowing with the Air Forces, put that shit on to the day that I die Nikes over Adidas, they're stressed and I don't even try